It was a quiet day in Argentina today as public transport networks ground to a halt. It was due to a general strike organized by opposition unionists demanding lower income taxes. Union members went on strike across Argentina, shutting down banks, ports and public transportation. The strike is an attempt to add an element of social conflicts to Argentine politics. It was organized by anti-government forces as the country prepares for a presidential election in October. Our correspondent Laureano Ponce now with this update. Under the pretext of uh, asking for a hike in the exemption level of the income tax, 23 transport labor unions started today a 24-hour strike which affects both passenger and freight transportation. Government officials harshly criticized this measure. Economy Minister Axel Kisilov said that this is a political strike in an election year, explaining that this only these income taxes only affect the 10% of the registered workers, which is also the wealthiest 10%. Transport Minister Florencio Randazzo also said that the strike is totally out of place as it is led by the unions which have benefited from the current administration policies. Nevertheless, the government officials also made it very clear that no union will be sanctioned for this measure. Laureano Ponce, Telesur, Buenos Aires.